Yeah. All right, good guess. Okay. Howdy. The Righteous Farmer here with a video about the ever-popular Cuckoo outboard motor engine four-stroke four-horsepower marine boat motor. I can't act, pronounce the actual name, so I'm going to call it the Cuckoo. I ran into a problem with my new unit the other day, and the solution might prove useful to you someday if you own one or are thinking about purchasing one. What happened was about five minutes into the shakedown cruise on the water, the motor ran wild and the propeller stopped turning. Luckily, at four and a half miles an hour and five minutes away from the put-in, my trolling motor was easily able to get me back. Well, I shot the video you are about to see with the intentions of sending it to the cuckoo support. When I got in touch with them, they were aghast and sent me out a new clutch right away. It was our best guess. Uh, just so you know, the shear pin, I checked it right off the bat. There was nothing wrong with that, so it's not that. Uh, so it had to be the clutch, right? Well, after removing the brand new old one and putting in the newer one, the prop seen here still refused to turn. So back to the bench. Of a fine, fine Saturday morning, my son and a friend from church came by, both better mechanical engineers than I admitted. My son had the impact drill it takes to get the 10 millimeter bolt off the clutch, and that worked great. Tap, tap with a wrench handle on those uh, two big bolts you see, and the clutch came right off. Not pictured, removing the motor head from the shaft is like nothing. Four bolts is all that's holding the thing on. And they come off with an Allen wrench. Uh, and as a matter of fact, the Allen wrenches are in your toolkit that comes with the motor if you don't have one. So I'm showing all my video here to you, which if you have to go this route, I'm sure will instill hope. The whole affair below the motor is dirt simple. Nothing to go sproing and fall out, I promise. Spoiler alert, it wasn't the clutch. As a matter of fact, the problem is right there in front of your eyes for most of the video. Can you spot it? We didn't. Toward the end, the problem will be revealed. I hope this helps you someday, some way. In my case, possibly a fluke problem that will never happen again in a billion years. And then again... Maybe it happens every Friday. I don't know. Yeah, it hasn't grabbed this at all. Because there is no sign of life on there. Well, I mean, nothing fell out, you know, when we took it, when I took it apart. No, I mean, no. So. so you're thinking if it was running, if you could run it without that yeah. shaft? Yeah, you can see it actually you... spring. It's do what it's supposed to do. Yeah, where it... but we well. shouldn't having to be doing all this extra steps to get it going. Because <laughs> this goes up in here like it's supposed to. Let me see how original was. Yeah, you could tell it grabbed for a minute, you know, when it was working. Uh -huh. But this one right here is, shows no sign of wear from what we just did. Is this, a, is that a direct uh, replacement for this type? It's not the same. No, it's not the same. There, there is no keyway at all. Huh. Well, maybe my buddies, I mean, this is something that they know. I mean, this is all they do. I mean, you know, maybe they can tell me what we're missing here. Hmm. All right. But you can feel these grooves in here. I mean, this thing, this didn't make those grooves. It's still like brand new. Mm -hmm. But when we're filling with this, our propeller ain't turning. What yeah, but I can. I can stop. Let me turn the propeller and see what happens, huh? Nothing. 
You can well, feel it turn. You, you can feel it turning something. See? Stop! Stop doing that. It ain't, we ain't turning right now. Where's that sound coming from? Right in here somewhere. Right here. If I turn the propeller, what happens? You're turning it, but I'm getting. It's just clicking. I mean, you turn it backwards. Now, there you go. See, when you're turning that, it should be turning my this in my finger right now. Uh -huh. I think See. something's broken here. Yeah, because it's rattling. Something's broken there, you say, huh? Because maybe this is working and it's spinning the crap out of it, and it just ain't working. Yeah. Does that make sense? Yeah. Something, something inside this shaft has come disconnected. Yeah. Okay, say that again with you doing what you're doing there. <clears throat> this is going to the factory. Yeah, this is this is I believe this might be working fine. Mm -hmm. I believe what let go is something inside this shaft. Because I'm spinning this and there's no there's, there's nothing going on with the propeller. Let me spin it backwards just to make sure. But when nothing you happens. but when you spin it what happens when you spin the propeller? That barely spins, but I can put my finger on it and stop, stop it. it. Okay. Yeah. There's no resistance at all. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, something, it's either something right here where this right here links to this shaft goes down the propeller or maybe on that end. I'm not sure. Okay. But I think this could be working fine, but this could work perfectly and nothing's going to happen on, the, hey, on your business end. Hey, Ed, since this only has that for like a set screw, and this one is, looks like it's holding this clamp on. Do you think you can take, loosen that and just take that off? Well, we'll, yeah, we'll, we'll get back with this on another video. <laughs> yeah, I'd rather I'm not see me tear it up worse. Yeah, a bunch of parts fall out. We know we did the wrong thing, right? And that's a whole different damn... Well, well they're, they're, uh, you know, I had the kit that evidently got thrown to the trash can had everything in it. A lot like a diagram, the parts. No, the, the turnarounders and such. It had everything you need. The tool kit and it got gone. Oh, okay. Well, you know what Archie said, don't you? Well, don't do that. Oh, not it. Ain't that where you got that BR549? I know. And then you added a two. It just always, that, some, that came from Daddy, actually. All right, we got it off now. What? Those splines look good. Can you see them? I can really see that. All right, now try. Let's try to spin that propeller. I got this. Oh, we're pretty much almost done. Now let me hold this. Spin it. All right, stop. Uh -huh. You got no pliers out here, do you? I can get some. Yeah, I want to hold this uh -huh. and see if we can spin it because if that's the case, then something's wrong right here. Uh -huh. But while I'm spinning this and it's working, but yeah, I want to hold this steady and see if we can spin that and see what it does. Okay. Okay. Stand by. I might need needle nose or something. That's right here. Yeah, I think that's hard to grab a hold wrong. of it. Yeah. Try that. Hey, I was connected. Hey, see if you can see that star moving. It's moving. So let's try that. Mm. Yeah, okay, okay. I think it might which way was this? Yeah, like that. Hey, could that thing have could that thing have come loose and slid up and off it? Let's don't take a video. Hmm? Well, that's uh, okay. Okay, now, try to spin the propeller. You can't spin it. Uh-uh. Okay. The thing slid up, didn't it? We ain't there yet. So maybe we'll tighten this, tighten that down. Well, it's got a hole on the side of the shaft, right, right here, one. And then there's no right there. It looks like it's clamped down. So, yeah, so we just... But they really all... Be in alignment before it's clamping it down. Is there a hole in the in the in that hub right there? 
the match, you know? See it? Hang on, hang on one second. We're going to find it out. Hey, he must put this thing together on a uh, Friday. Friday at five o'clock. Well, they're not going to be interested in all this. Just if it's, if I say it's working, that's all they care about. Yeah. Mm. Did you put this on? Me? No. Okay. All right. All right. Now? Let's get back. What about now? Wait a minute. Well, maybe I. Mm -hmm. No, let's. Was it loose? Connected. No, I put. I put that on. Okay. I didn't put that on. All right. Now let's. Reattach it. Was it sideways or what? That gas tank was on that side. This side? Yeah. Or this side. This, this side over here. Mm -hmm. Good. Oh, okay. That's it. Here you go. Uh, do it. Uh, do it. Bravo, monstrous.